for Muslim Federation of South Florida embrace an issue of census. The census, uh, a federal government does census every 10 years, right? And next year, in 2020, kids, hello, boys, I think you should hear this message. So the census will be conducted next year, sometimes in February until July. It is very, very important for us to um, respond to census uh, letter that you're going to get to your home and basically register all members of your household for the census. This is not about voting. Not about voting. It's about taxes that you pay. Government decides how to spend these taxes then based on the census data. So if we register and register in large enough numbers, some of that money comes back to us in various ways, through schools, through roads, through other things. The reason why Muslim um, Federation of South Florida also wanted to embrace this issue, because the census can help us Muslims in several different ways. I'll give you just one example. If enough of us right, respond to census and say, what language we speak at home. For example, we speak Arabic at home. We can then maybe in the future expect to teach Arabic in school, like they do in some parts of our country, right? So participation in census will be helpful for our efforts in that way. Because when we go to speak to the official sphere of our new country, you know, we need to show some data, and part of this is through census. But also, like you live in the community where you live, and the census helps the community get source, get funded, or get money, so that they can build schools, they can build hospitals, they can build roads, they can build parks. Very important to register every person in the household. So meaning a baby two year old, and the person 99 year old. Whoever lives in the household at the time when you get census paper, whether the person is uh, legal, illegal, whatever it is, he should be counted in the census data. Census are done in this country since 1790, since the country was born. And census are a basic tool of policy making, even in the Quran they mention uh, the census, but as counting people and all that stuff. So, I am here just to tell you the census will be happening. It's going to happen during the middle of the election season, so people may not notice it. It is not about election. It's about basically all of us paying taxes, so maybe we should get some of this money back invested into what we do. Every city that we live in, for any person that doesn't respond, that's what the Pompano, they reached out to us and asking us to help them, they lose about $650 per person per year. So in 10 years, because the census are done every 10 years, that means for every person not registered, they lose six and a half thousand dollars. So imagine times they have in Pompano estimate, but 120,000 people didn't respond. This is why the street looks like this, because this area is literally a dead zone. Practically, for federal government, no one lives around us. <laughs> While we know that they do, but they don't make uh, spending priorities based on what we tell them, they make spending priorities based on that data. So please talk to your friends, your relatives, whether they're here or anywhere in the country, encourage them to participate. Various groups in these countries are working hard to scare us so that we don't participate in census, because there are lots of stuff happening behind the scene. Uh, and we should not be intimidated, and as I can, you're paying taxes. If you want some of these taxes to be spent on you and what your family needs, the best way to do it is to respond to census. For the first time ever, this time, they will do first round of census through internet. So they will send you a code. They don't send the data to your name. They send the data or letter to your house. Right, so it's, they, it's mail last time 134 million pieces of mail because every house pays taxes so they know houses. And they will give you a code 
We can sign in online for the code. Let me tell you one thing. I'm sorry, I'm taking a little bit long. First, they will ask you to respond by internet or telephone. If you don't, they will send you a letter to respond in writing. If you don't, they will send a person to knock on your door and ask you all this information who lives in the house. Now listen to me carefully. If you don't respond to that, they will go to your neighbor and ask your neighbor who lives in that house. And they will get the information from your neighbor. So I think it's much better that they get information from you than they get the information from your neighbor. All right, so uh, again, it is important. I hope all of you do understand the game and do understand the importance of responding to census. And uh, it's going to be from between February and July. But the main part is until April 1st. Thank you, and inshallah, have a good afternoon. Please show a good welcome to the brother. Somebody to not check hands with him.